Hey guys, Susanna here. Thought I'd better pull my finger out and do a little bit more of this. This is what we've been up to since last time, as you can see all the stitches. Um, did all that and I sort of stopped here because we're going to put the top bit on. So today we actually get to put some of this on and maybe the garden. We'll see how we go. Okay, I mean... <laughs> For you it's just the next one but I pre-recorded all those other ones and I was way ahead and now I'm not <laughs> been busy doing other stuff so I had better um, okay I'm gonna put that there and I might oh cup of tea Oh, so good, so good, so good. Let me just chop this little bit off here. Okay. So just get your little bits and pieces of lace. I've been doing um, English paper piecing lately. And they do gluing. So me doing gluing is not a bad thing. Because they do gluing. So I'm going to be gluing some of this down and I'll be also stitching as well, but I'll be gluing it in in places where I can. Stitching it in other places where I can't. Um, so it's going to be interesting trying to Glue this, um, sew this one down. Okay. The pin will hold it, a lot of it down. Not the pin, um, the button. The, okay. Put that down there. Get this. And. So, um, what I would do is I'm going to get, now, where is the thread that I was going to use for that? Is it that one? No, I think it is that one. No, it's definitely that one. So, what I will do with that, and I won't make you watch me do all of it, because it's probably going to take a bit. So get your little laces, lacy bits out. I love these. It's basically a doily that I um, oh gee, it doesn't matter. Um, I got from the op shop and it was already pre-dyed. But you just get a lot of those doily tablecloths or whatever, and you can dye them. Um, if you haven't got dye, food coloring works really well. Wouldn't think to think of that, but it does. And your distress inks, they work well. I think I'll use that one a bit finer. Okay. So what I'm going to do with this is I might sew the button on, at least that'll be held down then. Really happy with how my little bunny's looking. Look, so short. Okay. Probably got after this one because I'm going to do a lot of stuff behind the scenes. Um, I may only have one more video left to do and then it'll be done. But I've got plenty of other sewing things I've got left to do. That's for sure. So I'm going to stick something on. This goes perfect. Perfect. Okay. Put that in there for now. Yes, I've got plenty of other projects to do and enjoying my um, collaboration with all the girls. Okay, where are we? 
is it? There, okay. What did I say? I think it would be easy, wouldn't you? Okay, not that right in the middle. Just goes really well with this button. My husband found it at his work. Ow, jeez. I don't think there an episode of this has gone past where I haven't pinned myself. <laughs> um, yeah, he found it at his work. But he works in the Salvation Army strip shop, so... Um, this one and another one I think I got. I'm going to stick this on. It's got quite tough. Okay. I've, um, I don't know what I've done, but I've hurt my back. A few of us have hurt her our back. I mean, the Rachel hurt her back, and then I was talking to Anne Brooks, and she just hurt her back as well. I think she's probably better now, but oh, must be something in the air, I think. Oh, my goodness, it hurts. So that's why I didn't do a great deal of videos last week until the weekend. Um because I was in a bit of pain but I'm a little bit better now but still a bit sore I think that'll do okay really enjoyed doing this bunny I've had some testy moments like last one I was a bit um just one of those days, I think. Okay. Now, while I've got the thread out, what we're going to do help hold that down. I might come up and do a just like catch. these little guys so I wonder if I can do that like a running stitch that I have to go up and down that may work you can't see me but you can see this little bit here I'm just going to go up and down that and that'll help hold that down yep and then I'll probably go around the outside and Hold that down too. So that might be something that I could probably finish off behind the scenes. Then I can show you working on the garden. Just come in from being inside and um, cooked a ro like a roast pork in the slow cooker and be munching away on the um like I take the bind off and I put that in you know make crackling oh it's so salty but geez it's good ah I thought I wanted to have a few second one okay yes definitely have to go back okay you get the idea so you just need to pick up see it's gone and then I might go back again and pick up the ones that, like these ones, because they go up and over. So I have to do that over that one, under that one, over that one. So I'll come back and I'll go back over the ones that I went under on. There we go. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to... this here just so it's out of the way unthread that that's all it needs for that part really like it and I'm going to do similar to here but before I do that I'm going to take this off get this baby and pin 
me stand. Because you know what I might do. Is I'm going to put it down first. Glue this bit. Glue this one down first. Excuse me. It's spring here and you can really tell hay fever and people look at you. I haven't got a cold, I've got hay fever. Okay. Okay, so we have that along there like that. And then these flowers will go in. I wanted to sort of have them, maybe that one going in there like this, going like that. Put that a little lower. There we go. So that this can go on there. Oh, I think I've got to blow my nose. Okay. Pause it. Back again. Feel better. And I've taken my top off. Having hot flush. The joys. The joys. Of getting older. Okay. Where are we? So, um, I just, what did I get with this? This might have been done with a bit of, um, distress ink or something like that. And I decided to keep it um to keep it white because um yeah I just think I like the look of the white I'm just gonna glue it down probably should just do it on here first Might have been a bit of um, the journaling, the journaling stuff I do. Now this has got um, tacky glue in there. I just use the the art glitter glue bottle because of the, um, the small nozzle, but it's got tacky glue in there which um it almost reminded me a bit of tacky glue with the original art glitter glue to be honest okay put that in there put it there that going so still want to see a little bit of his tail at least that's it's been held down but you know still going to be stitching as well just holding it in place it's only tacked now this this piece Is going to go across like that. I think I was planning on taking some of these off. Okay. And we wanted it to sort of go up like this. Okay. Get rid of those little bits. Hopefully you can all those in camera. I was actually thinking that that ought to go on the top. 
So once again, I'll do the bits that I can. holding down okay then This will be used for another piece. And this will get some glue along the edges, I think. Hold it down a, a tad. There we go. Then we've got this. And then we'll have that little piece. And then that piece it over the top there. I might sew that down first. I'm just, you probably can't see me, but I'm putting a little bit of the, the tacking glue on the back. glue into the middle I don't want to do too much because I'm probably going to be doing some stitching in the middle of that and I don't want it to be clogged up with glue there we go Now, quite like, quite like that. I may sew that down first. And then put that on there, and then I've got these tiny little, these tiny little guys. Just thinking, probably would look nice along here somewhere. Cute. But I do want to do, I've got this. And um, I'd like to do a like some sort of little tree thingy here and then stick these little fluffy bits on there I think that'd be really cute and then you know do little bits of glass and everything this is make it easy that way if you don't have to do any if you're not really big into doing embroidery you can do your scene with 
um, bits that you cut out and that's just from you know like material like that where you cut out um, leaf and um, yeah I happen to have a green green background somewhere here it is one of these ones so it's a bit of a lighter background so I'm going to do a bit of stitching in there and maybe even cover in some of those so it look really nice so I thought For that, see, I'll just have to keep those aside. And that too. I might use this colour. So, you do a stem stitch along here to join the leaves and that along. And then um, I might even do something up the leaves as well. So, I don't mind if they're sort of sitting up a little bit, that's okay. Um, I'm going to do a stem stitch along here and um, I'm going to do a French knot in the middle of these probably with, with that colour but I want to keep it similar to what's on there and then um, I might draw myself a little A little tree thing along here with a couple of stems so I'm just going to um, I might do that before I don't know if you can see that or not See what I've done just along here so I'm going to stem stitch that and then I'll put some of these on I might even use some of these like little leaves that would be nice and then add those on that would be cute okay so um, you didn't see a great deal of stitching today but Um, you, the, this one was a bit of a placement sort of one. Going to do a pearl in there. I might even do some pearls in those actually. Hang ten. Okay, and you'll be proud. I'll actually sew these in. Probably. There we go. I reckon they probably will fit in there. You can't see it from where you are, I'll probably just. I might have a couple of bigger ones and then I can probably put a big one in there. Just look. Yeah, I've got a couple of big ones in here. It's a broken necklace. This one. Oh, that's too big. Mm, not too bad. I like that. And then will happen so I'll probably have all that stitched on and then the next one I'll come back when everything is all done and I'll show you what I'm going to do with this stuff on that side and put these on um, yeah so I'm just going to go on there like that and then That'll go on there like that, so I might even have this up a little bit higher. There we go. So pretty. That will be like that though. So I'm going to have a little bit here, which I'm going to use for another little project actually. And then I'll keep that and I'll have another little piece there. Oh, that's so pretty. But I don't know. I think I'm going to do that there because I want that in the middle. Ooh. What I mean by that is that I would like that in the middle. So I may have to chop off here and here. Well, it's so pretty. So we're very, very close to getting done. I really love that. These will be tucked behind. And, um, yeah. So I'll catch you in the next video, guys. And we're really, really close to being done. 
Okay, so don't forget to get away bits and pieces and put them on and then you'll be nearly done. Thanks for watching and I hope you've participated and the guys that have done it, um, you know, send me a picture um, on, you can send pictures on Etsy Conversation um, or even on the Facebook page which is connected underneath and I'll catch you later. Thanks for watching. Bye.